What is up, YouTube? Welcome to Panfro Games. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to farm EV reducing berries in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. And if you enjoy my Pokemon guides or my content in general, please subscribe, like the video. I really appreciate it. So, EV reducing berries can be found in the wild. And honestly, they can be found pretty much in almost any area in the game as blinking items. And in my personal opinion, the best zone to farm these naturally. It's just running around the psychic gym area and eventually we'll find a lot of them they can drop in pairs of two or three and you can also get them from doing five star and six star raids as well but let's be real that's not that fast that's not that efficient it takes a lot of time and we want to get this stuff done pretty quickly and we want to get a lot of it too so why would you actually want to do this in the first place you're watching this video what do these even do well let's look at my pokemon for a second right my Skelly Dirge, right? I used this guy in the story, and it was pretty fantastic overall, but the EVs on it are pretty terrible. I have really high attack. I want to reduce that attack to zero, reduce all my other stats to zero as well, and I just want HP and special attack at max. So that is why we're going to be getting some EV reducing berries. So the best way to actually do this is we're going to be going to the Pokemon market here. The market can be found at Porto right here above the desert. And when we're at Porto, we're going to go into the market and we're going to see what these guys are selling. So luckily for us, we actually got some berries that we can auction off here. 60 berries. Yes, we're going to join this auction and we're going to play this auction. 60 berries is a lot and the range, I believe, is about 15 to 100. So 15 to 100. And it doesn't really matter. You can pay a little bit. You can pay a lot for your berries. Depends how good you are in the auctioning and also the AI in general. There's no 100% sure bet to pay the lowest every single time. But, you know, this is still pretty cheap overall, especially when you're doing raids. You're going to be getting a lot of money items. So you want to win this. But this only gives you one set of berries. There's six set of berries to get in the entire game for EVs. There's reduction for HP, attack, defense, special attack, special defense, and speed. So this is only going to help us with one of them for now. All right, so we won our berries. Great. So that's good. Pretty cheap to get all those berries. But here's the thing. We, he's done. There's no more berries. There's no more berries for us to work on an auction on. I mean, there's Rome Catalog. That's cool. Moo Moo Milk. Dust Ball is pretty cool, but, you know, nothing I really want right here. So what we need to do is we need to leave the plaza and make sure they're out of sight so you don't see the orange bubbles, right? We're going to save our game. And now, once we save our game, we're going to hit this. We're going to close our game. Very important that you close your game or this will not work. And then we're going to go to our system settings. And we're going to manipulate the switch's clock. System. And then date and time. And you want to go two hours into the future. You can go three if you want, just in case. But you only need to go two. But I'm going to go three, just in case. Because sometimes you never know. Because the, the market will reset every two hours. So as long as you go in the future at least two hours, you're going to be okay. And the market will have brand new items. So brand new balls, brand new berries, and other items too. And if you're lucky enough, you're going to get another EV reducing berry item. If you're not lucky, then you can just do this process again. And hopefully, you can get a lot of berries. But this is essentially the gist of it. So you can just get a lot of berries pretty quickly. You know, eventually you farm up, what, like 100 of each of them. And then you're going to be good to go on making a couple of pretty perfect Pokemon. And back to the market we go. Let's check what the berry man has for us. And the berry man on the left has new berries for us to buy. And what is our rate? 28 for 2,400. That is fantastic. Absolutely. I got to also mention that these berries do reduce the EV value by 10 points, which is huge. So if something has a maxed out stat, you're going to need to use 26 of these. Also, to make the Pokemon more friendly to you, too. So this is another way to increase the Pokemon's friendship. If it's like a friendship evil to like Riolu to Lucario, you want to spam a lot of these berries as well. One last thing about the market I want to mention, you can get some rare balls here as well, but he's selling curry powders, so sort of rare ingredients. But something really exciting is you can actually buy EV boosting items here too at a reduced rate. So potentially this is good, but not necessarily because you can always just buy these in the stores. This is really more for the EV reducing items is the best bet here. But there are some other options, which is really valuable in this market. So I'm sure a lot of people are going to be doing this. And honestly, money comes by so easily in this game by doing five-star and six-star raids. You can sell a lot of stuff. And you can also dupe 
really expensive items and sell those. Definitely check out my duping item video if you want to see how to do that. But that is how you farm EV reducing berries and even get some, you know, rarer Pokeballs potentially from the market and some uh, EV increasing items as well from the market for Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe if you're new. And I'll catch you guys next time with more Pokemon content. Peace out and have a great one.